Okay, so, back with your turn to die, death game by majority. I'm gonna hop right into it. Uh, monitor room. Why can I only go here? Right. That happened. I was trying to see how many tokens they have. Three clear trips, eight me tokens. 20 reco and 10 gin. It's it's broken. This time Professor Mishima's monitor is broken. What is this? The old guy, he's who would do something so cruel? No good, seems the computer in front is just for booting it up. The AI was stored in the monitor itself. Mishima can't be booted up anymore. I won't let them get away with this. They just fucking murdered him again. So, you did this, didn't you? What? You're wrong. I would never do such a thing. Um, Connor's with him the whole time. It wasn't so. It was with him. It's late into the night. It's Connor's job to watch him, so we slept in the same room. What? I was worried because she wouldn't let me leave. Though it ended up giving me an alibi, huh? It wasn't so? We never run into a case with such an unclear motive behind the crime. Who was the first to discover this? That'd be this policeman here. It was you, KG? What's the situation? Oh, well, can you get to sleep so I thought I'd have a chat with Mishima. When I came in, well, it looked just like this. Is that true? Yep. It's a shame. It really is. What's this? Why do I get the sense like Keiji's telling a barface lie? Um something happened? Oh no. no. Yeah, don't come in, woof. Huh? Bro, professor? Now. Someone did us in. I get the feeling this is both the wrong thing to say and the right thing to say. Someone got the better of us again. Um, please don't look for the culprit. What do you mean by that? Please let me be alone for a little. No? Hmm. No clues around that I can see. Yeah, no bits of wood on the ground, like when the other monitor got broken, woof. Nope, nothing. So the evidence is cleaned up this time. This is one nonsensical incident. I'd love to solve it right away, but we need rest. Let's do a detailed investigation tomorrow. I was thinking Reko and Kutara can wait till tomorrow, too. Mr. Policeman, you gotta find the culprit, meow. Right. We'll find who it was for now's sake, especially. It could have been now. No, now doesn't want me to find out. I'm not gonna find out. Yeah, let's do this. If it's for now, sick. It's not. Just not do it. Yep. I don't know crap. Hmm. So KJ's just questioning about the incident yesterday. Talked again. Can't talk to the old guy anymore. Wolf. Got nothing else to say. Okie okay, dokie, I'll trust you. Oh, Sarah, you something for me? Uh, you flirting? Yep, got rejected. That. That's bad and bullshit. Obviously, he was just questioning me. Oh, scary. You'd be a good detective, Rico. If you're not blabbing, beat it, KG. Keep up the investigation. See ya. Ugh, he's gone. Sarah, I've got something for you. Would you come for me for a sec? Huh? I found something curious here. Something curious? It's hard to see in the dark, but check out that wall. I see it. A mysterious switch on the wall. Notice the switch here? What's this for? I don't know, but it's an interesting note here. Above the switch are the words bonus attraction. Bonus attraction? You know what? I really like the idea of being a fucking idiot. I'll push it. What? You just want to push it, Sarah? Blood noise, something activated. Sarah, a door appeared. Is that? Piece of paper on the door, it reads, Room of Lies. Sixth reward. Don't be fooled. If entangled by the lies, you'll die. Warning, the bonus will close when someone clears it. Room of Lies? It's the tenth attraction. What's going on here? Shouldn't there be nine? 
yeah, we heard that, but in six clear ships. It's all suspicious, isn't it? Sarah, did you check all nine attractions? Hmm? Specifically, how many clear ships would you get from each attraction? Out of the nine attractions, seven give two, one gives three, and one gives four. Right? And all the attractions gotta be done in pairs. Right. You know, it's yet, there's nine of us. That's an odd number. Person can't re enter an attraction that they've already cleared out. So each attraction will always end up with one person who can't do it. Even if everyone who can form a pair goes around to every attraction, the number of clutches we can get is 84. And for nine of us to win requires 90. So short six. At least one person will die for not having enough. Six then. Wait, this bonus attraction gives us exactly enough. Ain't no logic in avoiding this place, Sarah. Grant discovered this attraction, someone could have died. Now it's just who does it? Who? Of course, I'll do it. But, but Reko, and who to pair up with? Well, so can't trust the shit. Getting kind of now, don't want to put them in danger. Agreed. Kitara probably needs compensation for events. If you guys were real else. Well, KG. No offense, Sarah. But can't trust that guy. He's hiding something. That was Allison. You know, I honestly would rather let Alice die than go with Greco. I'll pair with you. I don't even have to think about it. I'll pair with you. You can't do that, Sarah. Why not? You're overworking yourself. You saved our asses again and again. We're supposed to be the older, empathetic. I want to be equals with you, Sarah. It won't satisfy me just to keep getting saved. Equals? Go with the most trustworthy. But then don't be modest. Then please don't be modest. You should choose the best option. If that's not me, then I understand. Sarah. I'm afraid to just wait around too. You sure? You got the stamina for this? Yes. Hell yeah, I'm in your debt, because really I couldn't imagine anyone but you. Let's beat this and come out safe, partner. I grabbed Reckos that stretched hand and gave her a firm handshake. Then threw Captain Reckos' glove, a liquid trail, onto my hand. It was blood. That was when I finally noticed. Reckos had scratches and bruises in inconspicuous places all over her body. She had been pushing herself. No doubt she challenged the attractions to earn clear shifts for the weaker of us, like in a mount. No. Surely there were more wounds on the thin hands within those gloves. Reckos. What's up, Sarah? Forget it, let's go. Wait, first I'm gonna save. Considering everything. Cut. See myself in the Let's go. Is this is the room of lies? Pretty dark you there, Sarah. Yes, let's look around carefully. The table in the another room. Is it okay to approach? Fuck it. Approach and examine the top of the table. These are clear chips. On the right is a rope. Top of the plate with a rope like object on it, there's also a note. This is the web of happiness. In the final attraction, it may just save your lives. The web of happiness? It's sounding suspicious, it's safe to touch. Shinko cares to touch them. Is there literally anything else? If there's anything else, I would have touched it by now. I have no choice. Have to. Reko, let's take the items from the table. Wait, in that case, let's do it together. Okay, well. Reko, you take the picture trips. Got it. Okay. I took the world of happiness. Huh? Something lights went out. Ah! Reko? Sarah, run away! Reko, Reko! What's happening? Reach for Reko's hand once and grab it. Turn to the exit, Reko. You alright, Reko? Uh, Reko's glove. Reko? There's so many more lies. The room is shut. No. Bring someone else. I, I need to bring somebody. We need to open the door. Eh. 
What? Scary as shit. Huh? Are you okay, Reko? Uh, yeah, I wasn't scared. Something the matter, Sarah? Uh, as long as you're okay, relax. I didn't drop the good chips. Sure enough, she has a little sex. I got a cold sweat when I'm pitch black. I need to tell anybody I was freaking out. I wonder if she doesn't like the dark. I wonder what that was. You know, what was the lie part? Wait a second. Is Reko a lie? I don't have any idea. Maybe it's just for real, just a bonus. Man, that just makes it creepier. Hmm. What are we gonna do with these dubious clear ships? I think I can give them to somebody who's having trouble collecting them, but Sarah, do you need one? Huh? But you have being wary, but you've got a right to have some. Nope. I don't need it. Sorry. Sarah, now you're right to be apprehensive of these things. I get how you feel. It's not like there's anything I can do instead. Feel free to count me, Sarah. Hmm? Reko's hand. Wait, is this glove not yours, Reko? Hmm? What's that? Reko's already wearing gloves on both hands. Yeah, that's mine. What have you got, Sarah? When I pulled your hand earlier, I... Uh, pretty sure nobody pulled my hand. What? The muscle's glove. Hmm. This is one of my spare gloves. Yes, spares, really? Yeah, Ranger put full change of clothes in a room, remember? I don't remember bringing this. I Reko her glove back. Thanks, so anyhow, we should get going, Sarah. And Flash is what was it? It's what happens, what could it be? Nice and bird bang, I guess. We need to have time to do an attraction. I wonder if KG found the clock right. Am I thinking? That's a fake Reko. Dude just got replaced with a lie. I think he had fucked up doing that. not going to comment on that. I'm not trying to kind of like I'm now. You must have the professor I'm fine now. Yeah, it's not the place. I assume if I touch the hallucination, the level's just going to go up, so I'm just going to ignore the fact that I see Joe in the window. Just gonna ignore it. Nope, not seeing a thing. Quite know I went back in there. Can't pick again, so I leave. There's another thing I care about picking again. Again for this one. A Sarah again, so she to recover health. I right, scared I'll try. We'll definitely protect the Sarah now. I'm just picking again at literally every opportunity. <laughs> literally every opportunity I'm picking again. Now we dance begin. Start with me. Yeah, you know, good luck, big Sarah. I'm rooting for you, Wolf. Any of the rules. Normally, the order of moves your opponent does and repeat them back. Moves are up, down, right, left, and body. Body is the only touching the character's body. Some characters may remember the moves for you. Remembered moves are displayed at the bottom. Okay, so it's gonna be really good, but it does something different. Touching again will give me some light, some stuff, so.
that hard. Before it picks a Sarah. Yeah. Was it directly down or? Damn it, it was directly down. Yes! Did it! Ha! Huh. We did it again on the back. Who picks the Sarah? We're the ultimate team. Woof. Share these stars too. Meow. One, two for Bixa Sarah, two for me. Yeah. Negotiation. Sarah, I'm with my Rekka. I wanted to ask you something. So there's much something odd, but hasn't Rekko been acting strange? I knew it. Huh? What do you mean? I don't really want to say here. I'm sure it's strange. Yeah, I want to discuss that. I just want to see what these were up to. So this isn't a token chair, but to the talk with someone I. More or less gotten back in good health, Miss Sarah. I want to talk if you have time. Maybe I should be safe. I'd rather talk with... now, oh, honestly. Good, I was getting a little bit easy. What do you want to ask about Reko? Er, can we move away a little bit first? I'm so... Isn't Reko acting strange? Hmm. Something's odd. It does feel a little off. Huh? Like what exactly? Er... Let's see, it's just her behavior. Like Reko's behavior. That's right, something is odd about it. Reko seems somehow cold. Something about her attitude. So we're gonna kinda change with Reko. She went in the room of lies. The room of lies? Yes, she didn't tell you about it? No, I didn't hear anything. Sure enough, that's odd. Shouldn't she have given out those clear chips from the room of lies to others? I'm um, Sarah. Did you know about the wound on Reko's right hand? Wound? I gave Rekko a handshake. A bit of blood dripped down along my hand. Really? Yeah. Rekko must be hiding something. What does her wound have to do with it? Well, actually... Oh, never mind. I still don't know what Rekko's trying to do myself. It just clear to me she's hiding something. Hiding something. But if that's secret, if it's something she's showing for our sakes. I want to help her. Because we're friends. Now? I'll help too. Do your friends to me too. I'll assist you now. We really? Thank you very much, Sarah. I'm glad I could talk with you. Well, that's it for discussions. I don't know why you'd ever hit don't discuss. Sarah! What is it? Oh, sorry for scaring you. Just wanted you to come someplace. Come over to the ruined corridor, you hear? Don't keep me waiting. What in the world is it? Here, no we saw you, right? No, where are we going? It's your passage. The gap in the rubble here, can you fit through? There's a gap here? Where does it lead? <laughs> it's for you to see. What the? Where is this? 
Machine emitting red light. Is this a computer? Okay, it doesn't seem to boot up. Huh, you're late. This way, this way. KG? Why? Try not to alert anyone to this place just in case. Guitar finally found it. Found what? Kai's laptop, of course. What? Guitar produced a laptop computer from behind the rubble. It's unquestionably Kai's laptop, the one we found on the first floor. You, you found this here? Yeah, sure did. But this laptop should have vanished from the first floor after Kai retrieved it. Why is it here in the third? It's me. There's no mistake, this is Kai's laptop. The possibilities I can think of are either someone collected this and put it here, or Kai put it here. Hold the guy, seek the truth later, right? Sarah, KJ, I called you over so you could break into this laptop. You can't use a computer for beans. <laughs> Investigate what's on it? Let's give it a shot, Sarah. Alright. Okay, it's on. Please get us some good info, anything. But wait a second. We should come up with a plan first for what data to look for. Laptop quietly booted up and displayed a password entry screen. Hmm, not good, the battery indicator. But what? Shoot, still nearly deranged. It's okay, I know the password. It's mentioned in the main game. Password is still in the family name. Yep, password. Password is incorrect. What? Password's wrong? What the? You getting? What's going on? Why? Either try to change the password still wide to us and. Honestly, any possibility where I can blame so is a possibility I want. This so is explanation of why? Well, calm down, that can't be right. It's because he hit upon the password that he discovered Kai was the owner of the laptop. Kai changed the password, it's the only explanation other than the truth of so just being a lying bitch. What do we do? The battery's at 4%. Sarah, tell me something only you would know. I mean, I? Kai really had a connection to your family, but he used a password we couldn't guess. So we really narrow it down. If I don't you know, my family's just mm, nothing special to try. Kai, just what were you thinking? Connection to me. Family's got to hear in the shadows, Sarah. Father? Entered another password. Starting up, welcome. Oh, nice work, Sarah. Alright. Dad. I just typed in Dad's name. Did you know Kai? Virus in 3%. What do we do? Emails. Let's check the emails they'll talk about. Okay. I'm gonna log so suspect after Kai Redding was. I need to confirm whether those are real or all lies. Open Kai's sent emails. His plans have been able to been secured just in case. So no error in the date of the death game. Everything is proceeding smoothly. Feel deep perfection from Sarah as well as from a protector. I'm prepared to offer myself up for the Shadowans. At that time, if any harm comes to Sarah to Joan, I will chant against even you as an enemy. <sighs> They're the same. There they are. Yep, exactly what So said they were. And So wasn't lying? Wait, these emails. We just read them in reverse order. From the newest to the oldest. Sarah, there must be received emails corresponding to these two. Right, I'll check. Open Kai's list of received emails. There, sure enough, there were conversations over email. Sort them out, rearrange them in proper order. Sorry, the emails have been reading. You should tell us Kai's actions. That's one. Hello, hello! Did you know Sarah's going to a board game meetup? I wonder if she's going alone. Papa's worried she might make some bad friends. Sarah's looking forward to the games. Surely her friend will take part. Kai? Never told you. So when did you find out? I swear. But the only time I have any idea what you're up to is when you're they are at home replying from your computer. Oh, give up with the guard work. Thanks a million. Uh, th this is a message. It's exactly how my dad types. So your pops and Kai were in communication? Guard work, what's that about? Kai, you betrayed us, you betrayed the organization, betrayed me. It's that time. If any crime comes to Sarah, no one will stand against even you as an enemy. Unforgivable. It's all come to nothing. Just try and struggle with your puny arms. Hey, guy in this email. It's not my father. In the context, maybe one of Kai's parents. It says Kai betrayed the organization. Organization? Kai, what the hell were you doing? Emails 3. Hello, hello. Feeling kind of in danger lately. Well, okay, it's Sarah there after. She's being targeted. Attached to this house, but I guess I gotta discard it and run. Will you come with, Ty? Kai. I feel a deep affection for Sarah as well. Oh, sorry. Protect her. Prepare to offer myself up for these domes. But Kai, you really are the greatest hero ever. Think he's a million. My conversation with my father. Dad knew that something would happen. Discard the house and run. Sarah, were you making plans to move soon, say? I didn't hear about that. I didn't hear about anything. Sell down. Keep reading. 
Are you the contact? You should know not to use this address. I'll hear the report, but follow the rules from now on. This plan 70 people has been secured just in case. Is there no error in the data of the death game? Everything's proceeding smoothly. I see you've done well on the most futile effort. Thought you could pretend to be my contact and scrub things, Kai. You're at home right now, away from the Shadowan house, aren't you? That's it for you. The phrase you just sent, X people have been secured, is the trigger that sets the plan into motion. You fell for the trap, Kai. Sarah Chidon will be captured soon. Thank yous a million. This one is on the day of the kidnapping. It's a big idea, I'm not following at all. To sum it up, Kai was in correspondence with two people. One was Sarah's father, and the other was one of Kai's parents, who belonged to the kidnappers' organization. Since Kai betrayed the organization, he chose to instead protect Sarah. To do that, on the day of the kidnapping, Kai sent a fake email to the organization. Maybe the idea was that it disrupted the organization, letting Sarah escape, but his ruse was fully exposed. He just got used instead. Because thank he's a million, it's the sign off used between Kai and Sarah's dad. The emails were going straight through. All their exchanges went to the organization. No way. Then, then, Kai wasn't a stalker at all. He guarded me in secret to protect me. And the only time Kai left his guard duty, he was going to send emails from home. It's one crafty trick. Even after his cover was blown, I'm sure Kai was still trying to warn me. That night, coming home with Joe, that's why he stood in our way. And I remembered what the stalker had been saying. Don't go home. Battery's gone dead. Couldn't get any info related to the escape after all. But still, sure enough, Kai wasn't a good for not villain. Is that information really beneficial? There's still things we could check. If we can just get charged, we'll boot this laptop back up. Sarah, you hold on to it, Kutaro. Me? Yes. For the time being, let's not tell everyone else about this. Secret weapon just for us three. Make sure you don't spill the beans. Gotcha. But still, then, we should act just the same as yesterday. Honestly, though, I think it makes sense to give it to Cute Barg. Cute. 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 Cutaro. Because Cutaro was the person you'd least suspect to have a computer. <laughs> like, out of everyone here, who would you suspect to be keeping the computer? Uh, Sarah and Keiji, you wouldn't expect fucking Cutaro of all people. <laughs> yeah, hide the laptop in my bedroom and go on an attraction or something. Should get going too. Yes. We left the rubble filled room. Huh? Khan is alone. What happened, I wonder? Oh no, it's my three favorite characters. Okay, do you want to ask me too? Hmm, I want to steal it now. I don't have any so this coffee, okay? Why would it be, woof? Sarah. Connie, you weren't so? He doesn't seem to feel well, so he's sleeping. And it seems Alice is keeping an eye on him. Alice? Yes, it seems he has a kind side, too. I like this word, huh? Is it kindness, I wonder? Oh, that's nice. It's nice guarding him must be tiring. Yes, I'm just a little tired. Well, should we rest together? Um, I'd like to, but, or Sarah, I found something curious while exploring. It's over toward the room corridor. Maybe the room we found, could it? Sarah, I'd like you to come with me. Should I do? I'm going to completely ignore the laptop. Not suggesting anyone else. Let's go together. God, let's go together, Kana. Thank you so much. It's a choice I'd make if I didn't know. Okay, we've made it to the room corridor. This way, the secret passage in the back. This is a different passage from the rubble room. Good feeling. Sure it's dark. Who knew this was here? If you go all the way back, it's even darker. She seems likely to trip. Don't let go of me now, Kana. Her is just... Uh, sorry, I mean Sarah. Nah, it's fine. <laughs> Being with you like this really feels like I'm with my sister. I didn't know what to say that. <laughs> in place of words held Kana's hand as we walked through the dark. Here it is. There's a door right here. 
Just black to peek inside. No, kind of so, but lack the courage to open it. Ah. I'll go in first. If it's not dangerous, you follow. What's this room? Strange, it feels like I've been here before. Connor, it's okay, come on in. As I was saying that, it turned around. But, hold on, this is the first trial room. Bad memories surfaced in my mind. The very first death trap I was tested by here. If he hadn't made the proper judgment then, I would have died. But I wonder why. Something feels different here. I'm coming in. Connor. Ah. 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 This is the room where sister was. Because of me. Calm down, Connor. Held Connor tight. Firmly restrained her trembling shoulders. Sorry for getting distraught. Fine now. Connor, leave the door open. Wait inside the room for me. Okay. This is Connor and her sister's room where they took that same trial. I can't make Connor search it. Something on the ground. It's a smartphone. Kana and I have the exact same trial. This was probably the phone used to play the voice instructions. Did the kidnappers forget to collect it? Since it's here, Kana's sister might have had it. Which means... Maybe there's some message left on it. A message from just before her death. I have a bad feeling. I don't want to touch it. I'm scared. But if it's some clue... Check it. Please let my bad feeling be wrong. Picked up the smartphone. Did not have a password on it and unlocked it. The moment it opened, I'm as white as a sheet. I am not reading that out loud. This can't be. This is just too much. Can I sister die loathing her? I can't. I can't tell Connor about it. Sarah, are you okay? Connor's behind me. What's the matter? It's not like you yelled at something. Three steps away. But she sees the phone. Change the message. He has a shaking too much to type. Sarah, can you hear me? Two steps away. Where's the message? Did you find something? Probably won't work. Sarah? Six steps away. Good, sink or swim. Connor, someone's coming! What? Slid the phone in my hands under the bed. Is there someone there? His mom managed to hide without Connor noticing. <laughs> yeah, sorry, did I surprise you? I came to call for you, Connor. So? Hmm, quite the dark passage that was. Uh, Alice, too. Connor and Kazuchi rejoice. Shall the three of us trade tokens? Connor, tokens? Yeah, we shouldn't talk in a place like this. Let's head back for now. I, I understand. Um, thank you very much, Sarah. I was saved by coincidence. Huh? Aren't you leaving this, Sarah? Ah, yes. Check the phone now, so we'll find out. No recover it later. Ahem. Us three will do the token trade. Sarah, to don't, you should take a hike. Okay! <sighs> Fucking rude. Oh uh, yes, Sarah you don't want to... What's it? Well, I just happened over here that youngster getting talking, but... Seems like a ghost in the medical office. Ghost? I don't know the diesel port could take care of it. You afraid of something? Obviously, you can't possibly go do a track until someone, something is done about it. It's hard to be able to refuse. Oh, well, I'll make it a priority to do something about the medical office ghost. Real quick and I just medical office. Is it not a hallucination? <laughs> or regret it. Something's faintly reflected by the glass. Joe is there. Not again. It's a hallucination. I must just be hallucinating again. Yeah, worsened by 20. 
fixed that. I'm not gonna stay calm. How can I suffer? How long am I going to push the closet? The hallucination doesn't go away. In fact, I can only see it more clearly. Don't tell me this is. Joe? No, he's not reacting. What's wrong with my eyes? What are you doing? Don't go opening doors without asking, please. It's fallen. If you need something, please just let me know. Don't go searching around on your own. What is this? It's so fallen. Tell me, what in the world is this? Well, um, it's in there is a doll. Doll? I've seen them before as well. A doll of Muscana, a doll of yourself. I think if I do remember using a doll, it looks like me in the mirror room. Do you remember now? Yeah. What are they for? They are one of the experiments done by our organization. I can't say anything more than that. Like Joey really is there. If it pleases you, do you want to borrow it? Don't be ridiculous. Who would want that thing? My purpose is this all this went for it was mental relief. Precious person, you can no longer meet. You can talk to them or have them beside you. Adult, this is a doll. I don't need it. But you're distressed, aren't you? Please be honest, I'm sorry. I need salvation. You have regrets. If you desired it, you could have joined hands with Joe and escaped together. You gave, up, gave that up and killed Joe. I need more than that thought. Stop it. Facing Joe's Azuma, that is your only path towards salvation. That's not separate a season just for you. Allow me to show you a wonderful function that will make you feel even closer to this doll. Quit it, you. Katie, thank you. Isn't that a little too much interference? Maybe you're not a villain, but you're sure not normal. Apologize, I went too far. I don't speak anymore about dolls, or if may at least offer a suggestion. I have a device for healing mental wounds. Please come here before you kill these nations. Become so intense as to destroy your mind. That is all. Well, so long. Are you okay? I'm exhausted. Can't say I'm surprised. Wanna sit down for a bit? Okay. Sarah, did you? Did you like Joe? He was a close friend. No one else was as foolish, soft hearted, and cheerful as him. Yeah, I'll bet. He was so important to you. Regardless of liking or love, right? Yes. Wanna think of it? That's someone important to you too, right? So do you tell me about it if we survive the main game? I did. Back when your good old policeman was still in grade school. All I had was a single mother. You weren't fluent. So I went to visit friends, I had to borrow my mom's errand bicycle. The brakes on it were busted, so one day I fell off and the bike went sailing to the river without me. The embarrassment of being laughed at by my friend and the pain of losing my mom's dirt bicycle got me weeping like nobody's business. And there on the scene was the friendly neighborhood policeman. He leapt into the river and fished out the bike, and even spent hours at the police box repairing it. Fun fact, I forgot to turn off notifications and I just got fucking three DMs. I'm gonna have to answer that, but I'm gonna get to the point where I can end. So I can win really cool, he was my hero. So he was the person important to you. He's what made me want to be a policeman. I'll never forget it. It's a precious memory. Real or unite? Since you became a policeman yourself, did you two reunite? Well, there's lots of different people in the world. Okay, that's the end of the story. You calm down a little? Yes, thank you very much. So you can always depend on Mr. Policeman. At any rate, learn the truth about the ghost of the mental office. I want to get moving into the community clearing attractions. Hmm. I'm gonna stop playing for now. So yeah, that's the end of this one. Have a good one. Bye-bye and out. Try.